What's going on guys? Today I'm going to start a little fire outside and paint next to it. So hope you guys enjoy and uh, let's get to it. Oh, and by the way, uh, the last part, should be the last part anyway, of the previous video, the, um, uh, the new studio painting I've been doing. I'm just waiting for the, the flowers that I added in white. Uh, I'm waiting for those to dry so I can glaze over them because I'm trying to get a very vivid purplish color for those flowers and just the paints that I have aren't very, um, aren't strong enough for what I want. So uh, I'm thinking maybe glazing over the white paint will kind of add that pop. So um, that should be coming out in a few days. So I'm just gonna do it as soon as it dries. Anyway, back to this, uh, this fire. So, never painted a fire before, but let's do this. Not a close-up fire anyway, but yeah. All right. I've just got a tone canvas here. I'm just going to mix up a dirty color here. <clears throat> Some burnt umber. Let me grab whatever color is kind of dried up. Or like almost dried up. Let me first sketch out where this is going to be. Get some lighter color here. So I definitely don't know how I <laughs> feel about this. From a distance, it actually doesn't look bad. It's kind of cool. This sort of impressionistic style, or post-impressionistic. I think it's post-impressionistic, but... Um, Hmm. It's very Van Gogh y. <laughs> huh. 
Huh. I'm not sure about it. I kind of stopped recording for a bit because I didn't know how it was going to turn out. But I figured I'd turn it back on because now I'm not totally sure. bright green here. I'm just looking to see how it looks on camera. Huh. Interesting. logs to stand out a bit more. Alright. I think I'm... I think I'm done. It's a huge piece of paint. <laughs> Actually, I'll fix one more thing. Hold on, I don't like this anymore. <laughs> Let me fix a couple more things. Alright. Close look. And then I'll step back. And here is it, here is, here it is from far away. Somewhat far away. I don't know if this is far enough, but. Yeah, so there it is. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. I am not sure if I'm happy with it, but, uh, this was just sort of a <laughs> quick little painting I wanted to do out here, and it turned into sort of a very impress impressionistic style. Um, like I said before, almost like very much like a Van Gogh painting, just because there's all these bold strokes everywhere. Um, so yeah, not sure how I like it, but we'll we'll see. Um, Yeah, so thanks for watching again, and uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share, and we'll see you guys in the next one. I almost forgot to sign it, so we're going to do sort of a dirty red color. I don't want it to be too um, invasive, seems about right. I'm going to do it sort of the same style as the rest of the painting, just very bold strokes. Let's see if I can make it something here. I'm going to need a lot of paint. <laughs>
There. <laughs> it's a little big, but that's all right. And there's the painting once again. I did it actually a couple tweaks, but probably not noticeable. All right, see you guys.